does vibe coding? So, vibe coding? Well, it sounds like something you do in a beanbag chair with lo-fi beats playing in the background, but it's real. And no, it doesn't mean writing code based on how Mercury is aligned with your GitHub stars. Here's how it works. Instead of painstakingly typing out every loop, function, and semicolon, you tell an AI what you want, in plain English, or at least the kind of English that developers speak after too much coffee. Make a form that submits user data to the back end and shows a thank you message kind of thing. Then, behind the scenes, an AI agent powered by a large language model like GPT passes your prompt, recognizes the intent, and generates the code. Not just snippets, entire functions, boilerplate files, even documentation, if it's feeling generous. Technically speaking, it's all about token prediction. The model has ingested mountains of code from open source repos, docs, and probably every how to center a div article ever written. It breaks your prompt into tokens, maps them to patterns it's seen before, and predicts the most likely next tokens that would make valid working code. It's autocomplete on protein powder. And the tools are getting fancy. Cursor, Copilot, Replit, they don't just complete your code, they understand your project context. Some can track variables across files understand your folder structure, and even refactor things you wrote last week, but now pretend that you didn't. Of course, it's not perfect. Sometimes it hallucinates. Yes, that's a technical term. It hallucinates functions that don't exist, or it gives you code uh, that works perfectly until you try to run it. Think of it like a very clever intern. Helpful, fast, but occasionally delusional. Still, for speeding up dev time, kicking off a new project, or explaining to a junior how that regex works without crying, Vibe coding is seriously powerful. You bring the ideas, the AI brings the syntax. Coding has officially entered its tell, don't type era. More of this from the nerdiest people you know at craigandave.org.